Welcome back. Still looking at uh, TCS and um, going through the motions here with the uh, armored combat and AT guns and uh, the opening, literally the the opening move moves and fires of the Commonwealth in turn three. So these guys were here. Uh, one of them fired at a scout car that moved up here to create a dust interference so that these guys could move up. And given that that uh, scout car had already taken two step losses, they fired and killed the the car scout car so that there would be a clean clean line of sight. Okay, fair enough. That shot generate uh, an overwatch trigger which allows for these guys to do an overwatch <clears throat> which they did the reaction fire the fire back they knocked out just the one step uh, so this went down to one step and uh, the guy below still has two steps so all well and good now uh, we get to uh, activate our next unit and I then decide to activate these guys and they will now have three impulses. Uh, and we can do one impulse now, and then another one, then another one. We can spread them out over the turn, whatever. So we fired <clears throat> at these guys, knocked another step off. So I just took one guy off just for the, the sake of it, right? Just to keep it uh, quick and simple here for you. And then uh, they got to react. These guys got to reaction fire. So they reaction fired back, boom, knocked a step out. Uh, you can see just here. And then we uh, then flipped to our second in impulse and we said, well, let's try and uh, let's try and knock these guys out. Boom, fired, knocked out two steps. Thanks for playing, all right? Actually, it was one step. And then I uh, did a reaction fire here. And this guy has a strength of six and a range of seven. But because it's a tank firing, we can spot that guy. Oh, you know what though? His ability limit is 10. That will probably restrict that. So I actually, this shot doesn't happen. I'm so glad I did this video. So the one down here, this guy wouldn't have taken a step loss. So we'll take one off. No reaction fire because there was nothing left here. This guy's out of range. This guy can't fire because of the dust being kicked up by this unit because it runs along a hex side for the line of sight. And same goes for the rest of these. So that's pretty cool. So these guys have now fired their or done their three actions for the turn. And that, my friends, was a very, very deadly a little exercise in tank warfare. You can imagine there are, you know, there's, well, there's a Crusader dead there. There's a, a, a Hummer or what are they called? A Humber. Uh, I forget what that were called. Um, scout car dead here and four smoking wrecks of uh, AT guns there pretty cool and pretty deadly and this game now I know why it's only a 12 turn campaign because this is going to be over really quick uh, we have not even got to the point where all of these uh, four step Italian tank units come on that are basically equivalent to Crusaders, and uh, that's that's um, that's going to be ugly. They they get some other stuff as well. There's some artillery that comes on board, other bits and pieces, and there's also other uh, reinforcements for the for the Brits as well. But it's looking mighty mighty thin already. All right, thought I'd share that with you later.